Beneath the tranquil blue of the world's tropical and subtropical seas lurks a creature so elusive that it almost seems to be a figment of the ocean's imagination. Known for its near-invisible body and a penchant for remaining hidden, this cephalopod master of camouflage has baffled and fascinated scientists for decades. This is the glass octopus. The glass octopus, or Vatrelladonella richardi, is a little-known species in the larger family of octopods. With its ghostly transparent body, this remarkable creature is perfectly adapted to its deep-sea habitat, where light is scarce and predators abound. But to truly understand the glass octopus, one must first venture into the depths of the ocean, a world where the rules of survival are vastly different from those on land. The glass octopus inhabits what marine biologists call the twilight zone or mesopelagic zone, a layer of the ocean that lies between 200 to 1,000 meters below the surface. Sunlight here is faint, casting an eerie, perpetual dusk over the water, and the pressure is immense. It's a challenging environment for any organism, but the glass octopus thrives, using its transparency as one of its most powerful survival strategies. Most deep-sea creatures have evolved bioluminescence to navigate, communicate, or lure prey in this dark, mysterious realm. But the glass octopus has taken a different evolutionary route. Rather than producing its own light, it avoids it altogether. Its body is almost completely transparent, allowing it to blend seamlessly with its watery surroundings. Only its cylindrical eyes, optic nerve, and digestive tract are visible through its see-through body. This extreme level of transparency is an evolutionary marvel. In the dimly lit waters of the deep sea, any sign of movement can attract predators. The glass octopus's invisibility, combined with its ability to remain motionless for long periods makes it nearly impossible for predators to detect. The glass octopus has a gelatinous, cylindrical body that lacks the heavy musculature and bulk of its shallow water relatives. This streamlined form helps it conserve energy, a crucial adaptation in an environment where food can be scarce. Instead of relying on speed or brute force to escape danger, it uses its transparency and slow, fluid movements to stay undetected. Interestingly, while most octopuses have highly developed eyes, the glass octopus's eyes are uniquely adapted to its deep-sea environment. They are cylindrical rather than round which allows them to reduce the silhouette they cast when viewed from below. In the ocean, where many predators lurk in deeper waters, looking up for prey silhouetted against the faint light filtering from above, this adaptation is invaluable. By presenting a narrower profile, the glass octopus can avoid being spotted by its natural enemies. The octopus's internal organs are a giveaway to its presence. But even here, evolution has worked to minimize visibility. The digestive tract and optic nerve, though visible, are positioned in such a way as to reduce shadowing. The creature's invisibility isn't perfect, but it's remarkably effective given the challenges of life in the mesopelagic zone. While the glass octopus relies heavily on its transparency for camouflage, it's not its only trick. Like other octopus species, 
it can change the texture and color of its skin when needed. This might seem contradictory for a creature whose primary defense mechanism is invisibility, but it highlights the octopus's adaptability. When transparency isn't enough, for example, when hiding among rocks or coral, the glass octopus can alter its appearance to blend with the surroundings. It's a dual strategy that has served the species well in its millennia-long battle for survival. However, unlike its more colorful relatives that are often found in coral reefs or shallow waters, the glass octopus doesn't have to rely on flashy displays or rapid skin changes. Its body is less muscular and its movements are more languid, a reflection of the more passive approach it takes to avoid predators. Its strategy is one of evasion, not confrontation. One of the most fascinating aspects of the glass octopus is how little we know about it. The depths of the mesopelagic zone are notoriously difficult to explore and sightings of this elusive creature are rare. For years, most of what scientists knew about the glass octopus came from specimens found in the stomachs of deep-sea predators like sharks or large fish. It wasn't until the advent of deep-sea submersibles and remotely operated vehicles, ROVs, that researchers could observe the glass octopus in its natural habitat. In 2021, researchers from the Schmidt Ocean Institute captured rare footage of the glass octopus during a deep sea expedition in the Central Pacific. The footage provided invaluable insights into how the creature moves and behaves in its natural environment. The octopus was seen slowly drifting through the water, its transparent body almost blending entirely with the surrounding ocean. This was a breakthrough moment, offering a rare glimpse into the life of a creature that had remained largely a mystery for decades. The fact that we know so little about the glass octopus is a testament to the vastness and mystery of the ocean. Despite advances in technology, the deep sea remains one of the least explored places on Earth, home to countless species that have yet to be discovered or fully understood. The glass octopus's ability to remain unseen speaks to the broader evolutionary pressures faced by deep sea organisms. In an environment where food is scarce and predators are plentiful, the ability to avoid detection can mean the difference between life and death. Many deep sea creatures have evolved remarkable adaptations to survive in such harsh conditions. Some produce light, others have enormous eyes to capture the faintest glimmer of sunlight, while still others, like the glass octopus, rely on transparency to disappear into the background. But the story of the glass octopus is not just about survival. It's also about the ingenuity of nature. Through millions of years of evolution, this cephalopod has become a master of camouflage, perfectly adapted to the unique challenges of its environment. It's a reminder of the diversity and resilience of life on Earth particularly in places that remain largely out of reach for humans. Thanks for joining us on this wild adventure with the story of animals. If you love learning about the incredible creatures that roam our planet, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more fascinating stories. Let's keep exploring the wild together. And don't forget to comment below on which animal you want to see next. Until next time, stay curious and keep celebrating the wonders of wildlife with the story 
of animals.